My name is Dave Whiteley, I'm Technical Director of Invisid UK Limited, and I'd like to introduce you to uh, an app we've written for Inventor called iBomb. Now what this does is um, typically a problem that users have is when they're working with bill of materials, they want to transfer the item number from the bill of materials to drawings of uh, individual parts or components. So what we've done is um, we've written a tool called iBomb, which in effect, um, if I click on the uh, tool from the Envisage Apps tab, this will transfer the item number from the bill of materials to a custom property in each of the parts. Uh, and the custom properties uh, we use here is item hash as the uh, custom property. And what it does is it will bring the bill of materials up and show you that it's transferred the item number from the bill of materials to the custom property that you see here. And this is then transferred into the or added to the custom property in the parts. It will not um, add a custom property to uh, content center parts for an obvious reason because they're shared. Um, but it will work with things like uh, the frame generator. Um, it will uh, only work if, and it will give you a warning if you don't do this, if you have both structured and parts only enabled, it won't transfer. One of these has to be enabled so you can actually transfer item numbers under the structured tab or parts only should you wish. Once you've done this, if we go to a drawing, so we've got a drawing here of individual parts and there's a number of ways we can use this now. If I annotate and uh, add a balloon to uh, this part here and to this part here and one to this one. Okay, you'll notice it just adds everything at default item one. Now then if we go to the Envisage Apps tab and run the item number tool, that will now extract the um, custom property from the parts and then add the relevant uh, custom property to the balloon. And of course, another way you could do this is to add a um, leader to a component, add the custom property from the model, and put that in. Instead, if you want to add text against the item, um, and then if you want to, you can then uh, delete the leader and then this will move with the, the drawing view. So there you are, that's um, iBOM. It will enable you to work with bills and materials extracting out the, quite the item numbers to individual components and an extremely useful tool as part of the iTools suite of applications that we've, been, we've written for Inventor and all the details here show you how you can uh, download it and so on. Thank you very much.